Okay, so this is a short video on problem number five from percents. It's, I'm probably going to be calling this 17B. Just a short video of problem number five because problem number five was mistaken on the first video. So therefore, let's get it right this time. Problem number five, we're talking about percents. And the problem was, let me repeat it for you again, that a company has A company cut back 70%, cut back 70% of last year's, there was last year's workforce. <clears throat> okay, that's information piece number one. Now, they, they, the 63 workers were, were left in, workers, 63 workers still work, still work there now, work there now, that's after the cuts, or after the cut, after, we're still work there now, all right, let me, just repeat the word um, here there's the information here comes the question how many <clears throat> did they have a year ago how many workers did they have one year ago one year ago that is the question. Okay, now mistake was made on last on last the last video. It's being corrected now. Uh, there are sixty three workers that still work there. They cut back seventy percent. There used to be a hundred percent, right? Last year there was a hundred percent of those workers. They were working away. Now, we, they took away seventy percent of those workers. How many are left now? Thirty percent of what used to be there. That's the crucial calculation that needs to be there. So 30%, let me just write this a little bit in a, more, a little bit more elaborately. 30% of the of last year's workers, right? Of last year, I'm going to write this in a crude way and then make it more mathematical in a second. Of last year's workers turn out to be 63. There's 63 left. That's roughly what the equation is. 30% of last year's workers is 63. What do we want to know? What do we know, want to know about? What are we looking for? How many workers did they have one year ago? That's going to be our X. Okay, now 30%. Change it into decimal before we can move anywhere. Move it over two places to the left. We have 0 0.30, also known as, I'll put it over here, 0 0.30, also known as 0.3. So 0.3 of times, times, I'll put a dot there, last year's workers is X is equal to 63. And the best way to write this is 0.3X equals 63. Let me move this up a bit. I don't want anything out of the, um, out of the line of sight, if I can avoid it. There we go. <clears throat> so 0.3X is equal to 63. 0.3 times X is equal to 63. 0.3X is equal to 63. We want X. We want to know how many workers last year. Divide by 0.3 on the left. Divide by 0.3 on the right. You get X. Take out your calculator. 63 by, divided by 0.3 is 210. That's how many workers. Last year's workers. How many workers did they have last year? One, one year ago, they had 210 workers. 70% got lopped off. That's how bad things were. 70 percent that happens to be um <clears throat> that happens to be 147 workers well i mean it's no joke 147 workers lost their job and 63 are left in this company that's how devastating things were but that is the answer 210 workers is how many they had last year this is a correction of problem number five that's all i needed to do on this video it's a short video and we can stop right here